Worldwide, we waste more than a third of the food we produce, which in turn wastes millions of tons of fertilizer and trillions of liters of water. The food that is wasted will have added billions of tons of greenhouse gases to the atmosphere during its production. The wastage of food occurs at every stage of the journey from field to plate. This is the story of just one of those journeys. Mi nombre es Gastón Acevedo. Mi familia lleva tres generaciones cultivando nuestras uvas. Eh, se limpia todo lo que tenga defecto y también lo que tenga pudrición, si es que la hay. Y se empareja el racimo. Las uvas son seleccionadas cuidadosamente y se separan por color y tamaño. Tanto la forma como el peso deben ser uniformes para la caja, ya que todas las cajas deben ser virtualmente iguales. Solo tenemos unos cuantos gramos de margen de error. De ahí se trae con eh, tractor, carro, al paqui. The grapes that are up to standard are cleaned, sorted, weighed and packed. Once they've left the farm, they must be refrigerated as quickly as possible. Stacked in containers, the grapes join other products from across the continent to begin their epic one-way voyage around the world. Every year, Container ships, some of the biggest moving objects ever made, help transport around four million tons of grapes for international sale. South America is the leading exporter with more than a quarter of the business. The journey from Chile to Europe can take up to a month. The race is on to get the grapes to their next destination. So once they come here, containers discharged from the vessel, we truck it to the warehouse, we open it up, and that's the moment of the surprise whether it came in well or not. My name is John Mark Schultz of SFI Rotterdam. We source fruit from uh, all over the world. We have to do a QC check to see whether it has arrived in the condition that our customers will require. I think in the packing stations, easily you can face something like 20% of food that's going to be thrown away. And this is completely edible. There's nothing wrong with it, it just doesn't look as nice. Let's assume you were having a bunch of grapes or an apple from the garden of your grandmother, and there's one rotten berry in there. You just pick it out, and that's it, and the rest of the product is perfect. Nowadays, this one brown berry will cause a complete reject of one pallet of fruit. That's one ton of fruit rejected. But if it doesn't look nice, it does not get sold in the supermarket. Even once the grapes reach their destination, they may not be eaten. One study found that 4.5 million tons of household food is thrown away each year within the UK alone. We humans have accepted that we are wasteful. <laughs>